Hello friends, today we will learn how to use micro timers. So first we'll need one button. for our timer start and uh, this button will give one bit memory bit from our PLC is suppose we will give 60 bit number and enter more what we need to be size color anything you want to be here okay more off and one timer is on timer on let's uh, we need to go to in green here okay so I give this one timer on and timer off button then I need to display data of my timer I will make here size 150 by 70 so also same 150 by 70 it's same size now if we need any color background suppose black and text color I want to give the red Let's need more big okay. that's enough for me so how to we will write this one project now we have two things in timer uh, we go to our elements and then project micro clock micro so our first if what if is yes yes i'll copy this address okay because it's my input address i'll copy here is equal to on then our timer 130 is equal to 130 plus 1 so our one part is complete and if and And this one small, uh, very small uh, project. Just you will see how this timer is working. Okay, let's we will change something. Not to be end. We need to be on one bit. If. Uh, our bit how to we can say this one if our uh, timer value 130 is greater than or equal to 15 then what it will do bit on and we need to give the bit number suppose I give dollar sign five point 
files. This is very small project, uh, small program. So we will write uh, and if and and. How do I know the? There is no any syntax problem. Okay. Here is one another issue. What's uh, I give bit on? So I want to check the bit on uh, element I will go to one indicator multi-state indicator and I give this one bit read address from internal memory 5.5 enter and standard text picture I will go to picture suppose I will make the my pump okay when my pump is off it's red and when my pump is on it's green one another mistake here we need to be make stretch all and this one also is okay let's we will make simulation and uh, let's we will check first compile Two errors in output. Which error here? We need to check. Metro line number eight. So if then we need to be give should be else which is our mistake bit of our bit of which one this our input bit sorry not here here and second which bit of our I'll make copy and paste and my second bit will be of 5.5 and if let's check there is any output table number so in last there was is coming in one error that error was we are not give this value suppose I will sorry I give here the value is 130 and you can see this one 130 why because this is my clock value dollar sign internal memory 130 so up to here is everything is okay we will simulate this one first compile okay compile is done now I will try to page number two this one one issue first we need to be zero our timer how to make our timer also is zero here bit of and 
dollars internal memory dollar sign 130 is equal to sefer sorry zero because the turkish is sefer then update and close we will check again zero okay the our value actual we are give 15 but counter is continuous uh, counting so how do we need to stop this counting we go again in macro lock macro okay and here on and we give dollar sign 130 is equal to 15 update again and start simulation after 15 it's a stop now okay timer off now again time on Fifteen because this is maintain switch I'm using now fifteen off. So this is our single time. How do we use the multi time? I will show you because we need to be enter multi time value and also we need to check the multi time value what's going on and output uh, from memory bit and also plc we need to check in our next video thanks for watching